eBay, eBay, eBay views, views. Okay, it's if you have seen the thumbnail. Okay, on this thumbnail for this video, I put the view there on the view. You can see the view. Okay, crazy eBay views. That's the thumbnail today. And um, most of dropshippers and most of eBay sellers, they are concerned about e about the views on eBay. Okay, and because when you put the product on there, you want to have the view that somebody can see that product, right? And um, and we can uh, do all sorts of things to make those views good or uh, make them bad. Okay, there are bad views as well. Anyway, um, we'll give you some practical things what you can do to increase your views on eBay today. Okay, and uh, I know you heard already that uh, people are going online more and more in nowadays and shopping online more and more nowadays okay so which means if we just considered all this thing and just follow a little bit with our brain we will find out what does that mean that is, so that means there are more people online okay cool so that's good for us okay because we got some more views we can get some more views we put the product out there but the light is so bad anyway <clears throat> we put the product out there and we are expecting that uh, somebody will gonna see it okay and uh, that would be the ideal that's why we are doing all those sort of things like uh, titles and pictures and stuff like this because we want view views from the customers views we, we want to be visible okay because uh, if we are visible, somebody will gonna click on our listing and probably we will gonna get sale, right? So that's kind of like idea of why we are doing this stuff there and why actually anyone is... Uh... Oh, hello, there is some people are coming here. Minutes Craft, hi. I don't know where you're from. Can you put where you're from, guys? That would be just interesting, you know? Maybe you will say, oh, the neighbor is here. You see, it's my neighbor. <laughs> okay, about the views, how to get more views on your stuff uh, for free. Don't forget the one very keyword for free because what I'm doing on internet, first of all, and most of the time, is free stuff. You know why? Because free stuff is more powerful than paid stuff. Yeah, I know it's very contradictional to the most people who is out there. Germany, okay. I have been in Germany. Yes, in Heinchen. Heinchen? I there I was there for three months. Heinchen. It's it's a you know what Heinchen. The views the views um use free stuff only. Because the free stuff, when we use free stuff, what I mean by free stuff is uh, no promoted listings. No, because that's bad. That's real bad. You you put the you put the virus on your account if you do the promoted listings. Trust me, you put the virus on your eBay account. Virus injection. Virus. Then you will gonna need vaccine. Uh huh. You're gonna need vaccine. Morocco. Hello, Morocco. I never have been in Africa. I'm sorry. I guess there is nice weather, nice sunset, and the views are nice there, okay? So, but uh, free means organically, okay? Mm -hmm. The power is in organic, not in a paid crap, because look, 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 think yourself. When you do something on Facebook, and I guess you do something on Facebook, okay? You put something on Facebook there on your, let's say, business page or whatever, and there is no views. Okay, that's one option. Another option, you pay, you put something there and you paid Facebook. Okay, you just flashing money there, and Facebook promise, ah, uh, we will gonna put you on the views. For the people on the view, you will gonna get engagement. That's kind of like their promise. It's the same promise on eBay. 
when they said you were gonna get uh, views if you implement their promoted listings okay is that true hmm, maybe but how do you know which audience do they get to? have you thought about that which to what audience on the facebook you can target can put this audience for this age male female married single that country on ebay you cannot choose the state which state you do this you see and you have to pay for that crap this is not good the best is and you can check it out yourself if you do something which is interesting for the people and people get involved in this organically and when organically they got have you seen those funny the, on a facebook also there are those funny pages funny groups where somebody is posting some funny video or funny whatever it is and it goes viral just organically they never promote it there, i forgot there is one page even i don't know the name i'm following kind of like following i always clicking there because the people from all around the world put some funny really funny stuff there and people are so engaging there likes and, and and comments and shares that this goes viral on facebook every time never ever paid ad is there never have seen because it's not how and you will never ever ever see the paid ad with such engagement none of them no single ad i ever have seen as the pages go organically viral in in uh, versus uh, paid stuff paid stuff never goes viral no it's not the meaning of the paid stuff the paid stuff goes only so much as much as you pay them even the big big the huge uh, enormous whatever marketer you know there whatever marketer you know there okay put the name here if you want and i can beat that marketer down with the average facebook page who goes i said average the highest marketer your highest marketer against my average facebook page with organic view average not the best one because the best one views are a millions organically mm -hmm. likes hundreds of thousands organically comments tens of thousands organically paid on a facebook never ever ever in a history have been so much engaged guys am i right you follow me now if you believe that one take this mindset over to ebay and think a little bit how can you get that stuff on ebay because it's the same algorithm because you're dealing with the same people organic views versus paid views now why the heck people are so terribly trying to waste money for the things that are not working and do not use organic power which has been proven millions of times over and over and over again and over again and over again go to youtube oh come on hello we are on youtube here on youtube okay the biggest channels the biggest channels here on youtube millions of subscribers okay just test it out yourself i'm giving you some examples that you could understand the meaning what i want to share with you and you would just have this light bulb in your mind oh my gosh i didn't thought about that and you would start doing the same with your account that's how the power of use is making difference in ourselves because again we have been taught and we have been deceived by my colleagues gurus and stuff like this that are uh, telling you that you need uh, you need to pay for getting views you need to pay to be visible you need to pay for getting that software which you're going to promote your listing you need to pay to get that keyword tool you need to pay you need to pay you need to pay you need to pay and we got sick of paying everybody but nobody is paying us Hmm? familiar somebody said your courses don't work great 
my courses don't work. No, you are a freaking asshole. You need to work with my courses. <laughs> okay. And uh, look, when you do this, when you do this organically, organically it goes viral when you put the right stuff there and when you do things in a, in a way that people will get involved when people are going to get involved with that, okay? If there is no engagement, you can waste and waste and waste money. Or you can waste and waste and waste money. It doesn't matter. So now the question is, how can we, how can we make... Uh, oh, this guy is so stupid. You are so stupid, you know. Anonyms. Who is the anonyms? Such a, you see how the how it works. The people go around, they spam something, and they think they are just uh, they just get some engagement, or I don't know what they want to do. With this. Let me get rid of this joker. Okay, we keep going. When you do organically something, okay, when you do organically something, you put in a way that to get the views as soon as possible. How we do this organically, organically, how we do this. First of all, and it's free, you have to separate yourself from everybody else, okay? So how we can do this? We know that most people are trying to promote their listings, so don't do this. This would be number one, okay? What else we can we do? We know that most people do the same pictures over and over again, okay? If you type in there, let's say, wireless headphones and put some number, whatever number it is, just wireless headphones and some serial number, okay? You will going to come up with the 45 the same pictures, main pictures the same, okay? So all of them are the same. How do they get the views if they are all the same in the same line? So, which means, okay, we have to make a little bit different main picture, at least, to outstand from the crowd if we want to get the views. And that's for free because you don't need to pay anything to anybody to make outstanding picture. It's just up to you what you do. That would be number one, okay? How can you do this? What else can you do to get organic views free? and more well title of course the same again you just say that all those 44 listings they have the same title 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 right why they do the same titles because they just do some copy paste stuff or just transferring some kind of like uh, software using some software which is transferring the same information and then they are in the same basket to fighting for the price and to fighting for the views. Because when I, as a customer, I'm coming to the eBay, when I'm coming to the eBay, okay? And I see all the same in the line, which one do I have to click now? Well, it's just kind of like, you know, guessing like, oh, okay, we'll go for this one or maybe for the lowest price. But what's the point of putting the lowest price if we can't earn that way? I say that's make different picture, make a little bit different title to separate yourself with the title even, okay? Because that's the visual effect, pictures and title and the price. Yeah, of course, the price. Then you start digging in the shipping time. Mm -hmm. Okay, item location, where it's located, item location. Because what I'm doing, for example, if I see the headphones, all the line, what I'm doing is the first thing. I don't know how about you, but first what I'm doing is I'm my, my eyes are already was on the item location. Is it China? We have even the option there. We can click and say and, and choose only US, right? Because we want to delete all China crap and just get rid of those locations. We don't need eBay. Don't show me even the China stuff. Nothing from China I'm interested in, okay? We want to separate clean and, and to easy navigate there to make better choice to get quick shipping, okay? That's why some people 
put on uh, on uh, on their uh, main picture they put two day shipping or fast shipping but some people do terrible things and make uh, they think they do effective this but they put about three four logos on the main picture like fast shipping quickest delivery best price and uh, whatever like three four five logos on one picture have you seen those it's crazy it's crazy because you are messing up with the with the with the you make so unclear what it is sometimes we make the pictures it's really a, hard to understand what's the for sale there because there are kind of like all those logos over there and you can't see what's for sale what's what's the item is selling there don't do those stupid mistakes okay make clear view for the person who is searching for something clear view you can put the two day or or if you use two day shipping if not well, you are losing the views because people in nowadays, they are interested in a quick. You order something, you need it very, very quick. You need same day, next day, and that's what Amazon offers, quick shipping, okay? Quick shipping, quick delivery, and uh, next day delivery is very common thing, okay? That's why when you drop shipping from China or from somewhere, it's just a uh, that's a totally different story for totally different countries. We covered that yesterday. Okay, but for the views to generate organic views, you need to make the, to, you you need to give them the reason to click and view your item, and that's picture, title, and price. When we're talking about the price, there are strategies how to price item. If we price wrong, we got on the wrong side of the game if we price right we got on the top of the game and again it's everything is free you don't have to pay for anything on this one but it's just some simple things what you can do uh, if you are in my course 799 you got break it down strategy how to price but i assume you are not there Okay, so that's why I'm giving you some tips how to do this. And the number for just some few tips I'm going to give you, okay? Number one thing what you can do is, I told you already about picture title, but according to the pricing, right? When you put item there, you put item there with the mindset, with the meaning. Hello, somebody join us. Hi, Han. You put the item there with the meaning, with the mindset there that you need to generate, first of all, views. Okay. How to do this is if you put the price, that, that's just, I don't know, guys, uh, you, different countries here. How to contact me? Well, you, you already did this here. Hello. I said hello. Hi. You contact me. You say, have you ever, have you ever, maybe you have been selling real estate or maybe you know somebody who is selling real estate, okay? Friend of mine, he's in a real estate business. And he said, and that's actually, I learned from him uh, one of the lessons and one of the strategies I put in my course there. Um no, Han, I, I don't do tracking numbers from Walmart. I don't do Walmart stuff. I, I don't. I know people are doing this, but I don't do this. Just for simple reason, you are going to be messed up very quickly because Walmart doesn't like when you ship different addresses. It's it's not what we do. You see, and this guy, he's, he taught me one very important lesson. He said, that's how he started. And he gave me that strategy and I implemented that strategy on eBay and it, it was a bow. Okay, and this is in 799 included uh, in the details. But to give you overview of this is very simple. He said, he said, Andrew, when I'm selling, when I start selling years ago, my real estate, he said, I was taught by my mentor, he said to me, to sell three first three real estates on zero, on break-even price. Okay, you know why? 
Any of you have been selling in the real estate business? I don't know if you have been. Asher, hello. UK, hello. Nice to meet you here. Three, first three real estates he sold for break even price, which means nothing. Just whatever the, the, the seller was asking, the owner was asking, he took nothing, not from the buyer, not from the seller, break even, that just to make a sale. First three real estates. Other people don't do this. Other people are just trying to make out money of the real estate you know, business. He said, I was told by my mentor to make first three sales, nothing. Why? Do you know why? Because when you are newbie in a real estate business, when you are newbie on eBay, you need... Everybody needs money, but you need to build up your portfolio on a real estate business because, you see, if you are selling apartment for, uh, let's say, I'm in Canada, I don't know the prices over there, but in Canada, apartment here in Vancouver, different state, uh, provinces, different prices, but here in Vancouver, let's say apartment, two-bedroom apartment is about a million dollars, okay? Yeah, million dollars, this crazy town here, million dollars, two apartments. Two, two bedroom, two bathroom apartment. Okay. Well, you can find 600, of course, but I'm in a, a little bit farther. But anyway, million dollar. Okay. So, and uh, or 600, you can go a little bit suburban and you can get for 500, 600, the same apartment. Okay. Now, nobody who have a house and houses around here are quite expensive. It's just on average five million houses, okay? Canadian dollars, five million houses. There will not gonna be any sane homeowner who will gonna give you to sell his house for five million or even three million or even uh, two million if you never sold anything, if you don't have portfolio. Why would I, as a homeowner, if I want to sell my house, would trust you if you sold nothing, if you have no portfolio, or if you have portfolio with crappy, you sold one barn, which was broken, and you sold one toilet, which was portable on, on a sea, on a sea somewhere outside, right? I, and, and now you want, to, you are the real estate guy, and now you want to sell my 3 million house? Well, you know, thank you for your offer, but maybe I'm going to go somewhere else to find somebody else. Okay. So that's why he was, I'm telling you the story because this is so related to the eBay, what we are doing. And when I put this strategy on eBay, our views, our, our, our exposure on eBay was enormous because I learned from the guy. Okay. And uh, that's why he said three, I started, I even didn't look for the houses, Andrew. He said, I started with the three apartments. I, I was looking desperately, where can I get my first three apartments to be sold? Who can sell for nothing, for nothing. That Just to raise, just to grow my portfolio, just to have on my portfolio. And then the next three, when I came, he said, next three, I needed to get the cheap houses cheapest houses to go there because nobody likes cheap houses to sell there is not so much profit in that but he said i was told by my mentor to go into the find the cheap houses because now i got three apartments and then i got three houses and when i came to those house owners i told them hey guys i sold i know how to do this i sold already apartments you see this is the apartment i sold and here's the review because this guy's happy and he was happy because he didn't need to pay commission and the seller was happy and the buyer was happy because they didn't need to pay commission to this real estate guy you know he was happy okay and i don't know about you but i have been sell i, I sold two houses my homes two home, twice i sold okay and both of no uh, both of the time i sold them myself without real estate agent because i was not happy to pay them part part of my profit <laughs> so why would i need to do this if i can i'm not saying it's hard it, it, it it's easy it's hard but uh, you know all those things but but you can do this so and the next three houses this was the three times three formula he gave me the next three houses, I had already three apartments and three houses. And when I came to the normal house owner 
And he said, okay, have you sold anything before? I said, yes, I sold apartments, I sold houses, and you can see here is my portfolio. Oh. And there was portfolio where people were writing in good things about him because they really, they were really happy because he didn't charge for them. Now, when he got the 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 the, the property number seven, he got six sold already with excellent referrals because he didn't charge anything. Okay, he got into that house realm where everybody is competing for houses, but he came into there with the excellent excellent five star reviews newbie with five star reviews and his business went up like this because people started to the word of the mouth started to spread out more organically you know what i'm talking about that that's just crazy how it works and i start i i was when i was talking with him and uh, i thought oh okay it sounds like something what i can try on eBay. And what we did was what I developed, I was like came up with this with this not, not talking about pictures and titles, that's what we, we do differently. But we put always, we put always first when you put choose new product, you put you choose the cup. Coffee by the way. When you sell the cups, you put the cup there to break even price. First time, second time, third time. Three times I'm selling my cup for break even price. Why? I just explained to you. Not only to have a review, not for the review only. I, I got the feedback, of course, because the price is good. Okay, break even price. Not only for this, but to have a portfolio on eBay, which is my employer kind of like employer, you know, because I work on the eBay. And I put my cups there and sold. Good. Good review coming in. Hmm. Sold. Good. Good review coming in, in the form of the feedback. And eBay starts taking their attention from everybody else towards me. Why? Because I started to generate excellent customer service which is eBay's top request and everything start to kind of like going to my because my title was different selling the same product title different and picture different and now I'm selling with a different attitude three times zero and when I sell three times zero I start to build up price 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 okay and I ended up I ended up on that this is what we do guys with the, every single product every single product what we will put out there we are ending up to selling for much more higher price than everybody else on ebay just because well there is a point i have to be fair with you uh, we implement ebay getter strategy there which is uh, i have explained that already in other videos what the ebay getter is if don't if you don't know you can just search around and find out but but that's the that's the meaning start three times zero and then you raise the price okay and then you implement ebay get their strategy and you are selling for higher price than anybody else and people like more you than everybody else who are selling with the same pictures who are selling with the same titles for less price than you but they buy from you because of the portfolio you build for that particular product. eBay likes you and buyer likes you because what you did before they start to like you. Okay, so that's the way how you generate organic views, organic traffic, organic sales, which is more powerful than any paid advertising out there, guys. Okay, what we got here, let me just jump into comments. Okay. Reputation, yeah, that's whole reputation. Hi, Marcus. Hi. You see, uh, I don't do Walmart, and I do not recommend Walmart. Also, you can do this, okay? Uh, I don't do Facebook dropshipping, 
uh, also you can do this Facebook dropshipping, but I don't do this. You see, what I'm doing is I'm specializing. I do some other platforms sometimes in emergency on emergency state. We drop ship probably from Walmart, but Walmart is not good for the beginners. Beginners not friendly. I would say that. But on another hand is. When you start, I, I, I'm not saying you cannot do this. You can do this, and uh, if you know how to go around this. But but this is comparing with the Amazon. It's a struggle. And why would I need to struggle if there is much easier ways to do this? Okay, so because uh, Amazon is quite okay with that, but not Walmart, not the not the lowest and and, and, and Keymart and whatever. It's, this this is not the best way how to do this and especially how to start this with the all returns it's not so easy as it is on amazon you see we, i'm not teaching uh, also in my uh, my basic courses i'm not teaching how to do the high needle okay and uh, it, it doesn't mean it's not working there are good prices high ticket items you can get there and you can get good profit there Okay, but it's not for the level. It's not for the beginners. It's not beginners friendly because you need to know some tweaks there. But to get to that tweaks, you have to prepare your account ready for that. You know what I mean? All right. So it's uh, possibilities are out there many places. You can use many different suppliers. Okay. But the thing is, some of us, like me and my colleagues, gurus, probably, uh, not so many of them are specializing, but you have to. Uh, what, what I found out is if you specialize in one specific, like, uh, you know, niche, it's kind of like if you go to the car shop to fix your car, you don't go just to the car shop because it's just car shop. You, If you want to change the tire, you go to the car shop where they change the tire because they are specialists there. If you have some trouble with the ignition, you go where they, you know, where they fix the ignition. And now it depends. Come on, is it a diesel or is it a gasoline? Okay, so different specializations always better than just general dropshipping. So that's why I'm specializing theoretically and practically I'm specializing on Amazon although we are using different suppliers on uh, next levels when we go but we start always we start establishing our businesses always 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 with Amazon only because it's so friendly and secure if I have to put this big if because of this big if so many people fail because they don't know how to do this properly. But if you know how to do this properly, you never ever lose money. I never lost any penny. I would say in a not not no. Let me put like this: when I built the last my my previous account on eBay was last year June. From that time till I sold that account, it was six months. I never and and there was a. Uh, more than 10,000 sales on that account. Uh, I never lost any penny on Amazon. Although I got a lot of returns, I got a lot of scams. I have been scammed on eBay because of the buyers, okay? But I never lost money on those cases because Amazon always covered me. That's that's the that's the the, the good thing, you know? And um but but yeah, you can you can dropship Home Depot, you can dropship whatever local stores, dollar stores, all sorts of things you can dropship. It's not my speciality. Okay. This question I got on every how to put tracking from Amazon to an eBay. The question every on every video on every live I get and every Every time I have the same answer, I have a, I have few videos already out there on, on the YouTube on this topic, and uh, I have a three three solutions in the training program, which is generally you can do this tech, and again the same answers always because there are no magic and there are no solution as we are looking for. 
people are looking for that solution exactly like the question is how to put tracking from amazon in ebay and uh, what you why you are asking this is because you think or you perhaps believe that there is some way nobody told you i can told i can tell you 100 percent there are no ways nobody i don't care who guru is that there are no way to do this in a way that ebay would accept amazon's tracking number uh, one thousand percent and i can prove you this because i don't care again who told you anything but there is no way in to put in a way that uh, ebay would accept it and you know why you know why because ebay and amazon those are two enemies you know why Amazon does not accept PayPal's payments? Most platforms does. PayPal is not a friend with Amazon. You cannot buy on Amazon with PayPal anything, nothing, not even a gift card. You have to go through third party to buy. You know why? Because PayPal was worked together. They worked together with eBay and they still work together with eBay. And they were different they were enemies that's why amazon that's their inner political situation i don't know if they were going to change that but that's the biggest competitions two big competitions out there ebay amazon also ebay is a chihuahua and amazon is the german shipper okay um, they will ebay will not gonna go close to 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 amazon at any point okay they are not able to do this but they are kind of like struggling uh, because those are the biggest platforms out there and ebay is so hard striving and trying to survive under under amazon's shadow that um, they, they sided with paypal and uh, and uh, that's because paypal is not friendly to amazon and friendly to ebay so by saying this is um, they will never gonna be solution for that the enemy would accept enemies tracking number you have to be completely clear about that okay but what we do is we are desperately trying to how to go around that conflict what is out there you know how to go around that conflict around, uh, what is out there and some of the gurus what i heard they are they are openly lying to to the public just for the case of uh, having um, the views on YouTube that there is some kind of like solution for this. There is no. Technically, it's not possible even. Because what will going to happen if you put Amazon's tracking number on eBay and you put that and choose TBA carrier, okay, uh, you're going to be suspended not all the time but you can be suspended for that just because what you did there so that's why we have few options how to go around that conflict not to get ourselves into the middle of this fighting between amazon and ebay okay we have to be smart and there are some uh, okay solutions but not perfect because there are no existence on this earth there are no existence about uh, this issue okay but you don't have to be, uh, well, I don't want to go that direction now because it was not there. It's not the big deal about the tracking. It's not the big deal. If you do the rest okay, okay, it, it's not the big deal. That's an issue generally, how to get that tracking number on eBay, yes. But um, you see, we have, we have a choice what we do. We can leave those products because um, we can not trigger Amazon. That's one of the options. We can not trigger, we, we, we can not give Amazon the reason to give us tracking number from TBA, not to ship with the TBA. There are some different, I told you, it's, I don't want to go that now, but there are some things what we can do to avoid that happening before it's shipped. Yes, we can. Yes, we can, okay? And uh, if that happens, there is another solution. What we can do if that happens to us, how to proceed from there, 
okay so but there are no completely uh, like uh, one click solution for this and never will gonna be as far as ebay's uh, siding with the paypal and um, and uh, they are not accepting this stuff okay okay do we have anything else here any comments any questions you see there there is a um, let me take my coffee i can give you one more tip just because you have been watching so far and um, that's kind of like good thing to do sometimes sometimes when buyer leave uh, when buyer gives you um, feedback whatever feedback neutral or negative feedback and mentions and the buyer mention in a feedback word amazon you know they're like oh this crap was sent to me from amazon okay you can request that feedback to be deleted on ebay and they were going to do it for you you know why because on ebay's policy on the ebay's feedback policy you can read you can go on the ebay not on the youtube go on ebay there is a ebay's policy about this it's written that it's not allowed to put the competitor's name in a feedback not only Amazon's, but any competitors. It, it, if it says it was shipped to me from Costco, it can be deleted upon your request. Okay. If you are not requesting this, they're not deleting. Okay. But if you make like uh, you got negative feedback and there was mentioned that it's from the Amazon, why you send it to me to on Amazon, or sometimes negative, sometimes natural feedback, good stuff. Uh, only think, I don't understand why they sent from Amazon. Okay, you can ask eBay to delete that feedback because they mentioned they broke the rule of the competition. They can, you cannot mention, nobody can mention the competitor's name on eBay's site. Whoever that was, competitor, nothing. Okay, that's the rules. So otherwise, uh, well, there are, of course, there are, you have to, yeah, yeah. You, you, you can't just jump over there and say, hey, take away this comment. This is Amazon. But that's the, you will find out yourself how to do this, OK? OK, do we have any questions here? Or we are good to go? We are good to go, I think, right? Thanks, guys, for being here. Uh, let me so if you if if you have any comments, comment here. I will take a look later on, and maybe I will address them in the next video. Okay, some just you know some practical things, what to do and how to do, and um, yeah, because information is out there. Everything what I know, I think it's on YouTube or not on YouTube, but. On uh, Google, you can just search around. Some things maybe are not exactly in in uh, in a ways like I was sharing with you now with the strategy three times zero and stuff like this. That's probably you are not gonna find on uh, Google unless you are landing on some of my videos because that's what I'm talking about. Okay, but I just really encouraging you try. It costs you nothing cost you nothing right new product take new product put there and try to put for break even price and see what happens just test out what i'm saying okay testing out and if it's saying if i if it's working that you know that's true what i'm saying okay if it makes sense to you if you want you can keep your weights just to but that's that's how uh, i was able to in a 6 month to make account last year june that account what i have been showing in my trainings that account and you have been following some of you have been following inside okay brand new account made in june sold before christmas six figure account i sold it okay because i made by implementing those strategies easy i'm not working 12 hours a day on that ebay account listing thousands and thousands of listings no that's you don't need to do this you don't need to do this 
I never oversee 100. Never. I think my, my um, what was 72? 72, I think, if the numbers are right. 72 active listings I have on that account at the highest peak point. And then I decreased down to 30, 32. When I sold the account, it was with the 32 active listings, which was generating more than 30,000, 30,000 per month. Not in a profit, no, 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 not in a profit, in a sales. But then you calculate yourself, okay? You can calculate yourself if the profit margin never goes below 25%, and I'm talking about pure profit, pure, after taxes, after fees, never, okay? Because when we price items, we price items. And again, all those systems are in a place. Start with the three times zero, go up, implement all the strategies there. Okay. And in the six months, you got six figure income. That's what you do. Not in the three months. You can't make it in the three months. No. You can't make it in three months. I know there is a lot of hype out there that you can do this with one product. You have seen those? Videos, one product dropshipping makes me millions of dollars. Okay, I don't know. Maybe I'm a little bit too dumb, but I can't do this. I don't know how it's possible. Not even technically. I don't know where the money is coming from and through which uh, uh, the people are standing on the doorsteps and giving you the money. I don't know. Because what I know is whatever financials uh, organization you use there they were gonna put the limits on you that's what i know maybe i'm on a, living on the wrong earth i don't know i don't know you know that's why ebay came up with the security three months jail and paypal three months jail that's why the banks are giving you the security if you over go over go over the normal average limit with your finances then you've got special checkup on you I don't know how those people do millions of dollars. That's strange for me. In a, in a in a three months they made. I don't know, guys. I think this is. I need maybe to buy their course and see how it goes. Okay, and then make some other course for myself. Hmm. But in the six months, yeah, because you got out of the jail in three months, and then in the three months when you start again, if you have seen the videos, you see the, then you start making real money after three months but first three months you have to build 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 but some people got caught up with the building 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 and they build 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 and never really sell they just build 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 and build again and build again and list 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 more list 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 and they list how long are you working on ebay dropshipping i already two years what you are doing i'm just keep listing 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 what the heck you list start selling when are you start selling what do you mean start selling i have only two thousand listings active i'm i have a plan to get to 10,000 listings. Build, 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 build. What the heck are you doing? Why you should <laughs> list there? You should sell. You go to eBay to sell, right? All you need, you need just maximum, max at max. You need 100 products listed, 100 products. Because you are, we are in a selling business. But some people, for me, it looks like they are in a listing business. Which business you are, guys? Listing business or selling business? I, I, I can teach you only selling business. I, can, I don't know how the listing business works. My videos. I have on the YouTube. You can click on my channel, subscribe on my channel, click on uh, on my name or whatever it is under there, and you can search. I have hundreds of videos. Oh yes, guys, hundreds of videos. But but wait, look, look. You have to understand that I am on the YouTube doing this stuff already since 2016 on this channel. Do not go back on 2016 or 17 videos. Because that information is not applicable today, 
Hello, do you hear me? I have hundreds of videos there, but it's not applicable because what was working on eBay last year, oh, well, last year it's okay. It's okay, kind of like beginning of yeah, last year is okay. But 2019, 2018, 2000, don't even click on those videos because it's not applicable today, guys. When you go around YouTube, look when the video appeared on the YouTube. Those videos was applicable back then and people made good income with that and me. But eBay changed. Those are outdated videos. They're still on YouTube. I was not going to take them down, let them stay there because YouTube paid me small commission for running ads of them on them, you know? Why would I need to take them down? Because people who don't know that, they, well, there is some valuable information. You can even go and compare. And there is even some good strategies in there because something was, but generally, generally, it's outdated information. So when you go to my videos, look the, for the newest videos, for the this year video or, or last year from June. Last year, June and up till today. Okay, because on the June 1st, I open new account. And then you can follow all those videos from June up till today. Because you were going to see all the sequence, how I'm doing this and stuff like this. But that's that's the, what the story is about this. Okay. Find my products. Yeah, that's, that's, a, that's again, that's the video. I got the video. It's called uh, how to find product in less than two minutes. Okay, it's exaggerated, two minutes. You don't need two minutes to find the best selling product. It's in a video on the YouTube. You don't even need to be in my course, in my training, because it's in the YouTube. How to find the best selling product, guarantee you are gonna sell it. I can guarantee you are gonna sell it if you follow that video. You hear me? Who was the, who asked me? Who was the guy who asked me? Now I lost the comment, but somebody asked me that. Whatever, somebody asked me how to find him. And uh, here is the usher. Yeah, go there. I guarantee if you follow that video, and that's for free. I'm not asking you the money for that. Okay, don't give you guarantee on my paid stuff. My free stuff is working. Okay. Less than two minutes, three clicks you need to do on your laptop to find the best selling product. Whatever you like, product. Hi, sir. I can see. Yeah, I, I understand what you are writing. I understand Russian. Yes. Pioneer on uh, already appeared on eBay. Mm, uh, Pioneer on eBay. I, I'm not sure. I have Pioneer account and a Pioneer bank account, and uh, uh, it's different. I'm not using for eBay, but uh, for my Amazon's business, Pioneer is connected to me, and uh, you can uh, transfer money from PayPal to Pioneer. Okay. And then from the pioneer, you can buy for the same money. You don't need to convert currency. You transfer money from PayPal, US dollars to pioneer, which is American bank. Okay, you got US currency there, US currency there. And then with the pioneer card, you pay gift card on Amazon. Okay, and that's the only, uh, well, not the only way, but at least the way i'm using and i'm doing and i'm teaching my private clients what we do uh, we transfer money the funds from paypal to amazon on a gift card account and then you're checking out from the gift card and the money doesn't go through your bank account you know what i mean you're kind of like not showing up in your bank that there is extra money going through circulation you use paypal gift card paypal gift card paypal gift card and it's very easy to go there if you if you need to open the pioneer account i can drop the below there a link which will gonna lead you straight away to pioneer uh, 
<laughs> Asher says, I don't have time to list. I want to sell. Yeah, that's my man. That's what we do. You see, guys, the, 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 this is this the, t- different strategies out there, different strategies. I am the fan of listing 30 items and sell them all of them. Not always I'm succeeding with this, to be honest, okay? Making still mistakes, but that's kind of like my plan and what I'm teaching my private clients when they come to my, okay, whatever they have, 200 listings or 2,000 listings, I said, we're going to get some job done here. Down everything, almost, you know, everything down because you have been working too much for too nothing. Okay, now we start from nothing, okay? And we were going to put something only what sells. I can do another video on this, not today. But what sell, okay? And when those things start selling, we are working around them to sell them more, to sell them more, to sell them more. Not to list more, but to sell more. That's what I'm saying. I'm in a selling business, not in a listing business. I teach people how to sell. When the private clients come to me, they have been mostly on a listing business. And I have to transfer their thinking and their actions into selling business. You know what I mean? That's a different dropshipping. Okay, you got it. Cool. Uh Search goodwill and second-hand goods. Uh, yeah, that that's that's a good. You see, I'm not in America. I'm not in America. Americans they can make crazy big money on the, what you're just uh, saying here. Why don't you resell goodwill and second-hand goods? Because uh, in Canada, where I am in Canada, uh, eBay and Amazon. It's not work. It's not the same as they have in America. Okay, in America you can go. Um, I have one student, one one of my clients, uh, private client. Uh, he was very very good at the garage sale. He go to the garage sale every weekend. He said he said Andrew, you are not gonna believe. I spent fifty dollars on garage sale, and I got back thousand. On average, he said fifty spent. Thousand back, fifty spent, thousand back. Crazy. And people in America, they are complaining they don't have money. It's crazy. It's crazy because in Russia, if you know, you know the guy Gary Vaynerchuk, right? Gary Vaynerchuk. He's. Uh, it's one of his kind of like business strategies how he teach to make money. You know Gary Vaynerchuk? Who knows Gary Vaynerchuk out there? Somebody say hello. You know Gary Vaynerchuk? And uh, this is the one of this, uh, the millionaire guy, the millionaire guy, really. And the marketing and the coach and consulting firms and companies, like big, huge companies. And he's going out in garage sales, picking up stuff. <laughs> okay. Uh, you don't know? Gary Vaynerchuk, he's uh, from uh, Belarus, Belarus originally but he have been raised and born in uh, in uh, new york so that's how you just gary vinerchuk vinerchuk vine media his parents are owning and uh, I, yeah i will try i will put i will put the, his name i don't know my spelling is not very good so i'm sorry because you see i never learned english in a school just learn english by doing business <laughs> and uh, and that's what he did he was driving around with his team, kind of like two other guys, the operator who is filming all the time, and he, and he goes to garage sales and he's picking up the all sorts of things. You have to know a little bit what is selling on eBay, picking up all sorts of things, and then he's just posting them on the eBay, making crazy money out of it. It's just documented videos. Sometimes I will put the name. I will put the name. Uh, you can watch. Uh, it, it's crazy. It's he's the one who is. Uh, He's very energetic, very, you were going to guys like him. And uh, it's a lot of things just to get inspiration from him. And uh, crazy, crazy, interesting videos how he goes to garage. And the garage sales in America is crazy. The dollar store, garage sales. When I lived in America, there was, uh, you know, stores are going down. You just, just, you just take those down. Pair of jeans, 
two bucks, three bucks. Yeah, brand new with labels, with everything. Take it home. Go there. You know what the people, you have you seen those videos that um, in, uh, again, it's on the YouTube there where people go the when they shop in uh, in a Ross, for example, that's the one of the common places in uh, where the low prices, Nikes, Adidas, all the stuff, the shoes, the, the sneakers, they shop all kind of like Gucci stuff on everything. They shop in the in a Ross. There are videos how they do this uh, on a shop. Full, full cart, like a really full cart. They pay, I don't know, thousands of dollars driving out to the car, jumping in every car, and then they post them on the eBay, okay? And if it's not selling, they are taking it back to the shop. You know, what's not selling, they're taking back to the shop. They got money back. What's selling, they sell. It. <laughs> and it's again, it's a huge difference in the prices. So that's why I'm saying if you live in America and you don't have money, there should be something wrong with your upper part of your body. Okay, so uh, it's uh, it's not in every countries. We are not so fortunate here in Canada, and not so fortunate people in Europe or somewhere in the world there. But uh, Zainola Dean, hello. I think I know you, maybe. Luis, yes, Gary V. That's that's how it is, Luis. Yes, you got it, Gary V. Gary Vanish or Gary V, you can find him. Look what Louis typed in here, Gary V. You can copy that name and post in a, in a YouTube. You will find Gary V and, uh, and uh, about his eBay garage sales or something at their Gary V garage sales or something like this. And you will find a very funny videos. Not funny, but really inspirational videos how, how, how people can make money. Okay. Um, No, I'm not thinking to you to move to US, uh, not particularly to US. There was a time when I was thinking to become American, but uh, not anymore, not anymore. This is what's going on in US right now. I'm sorry if you are from US, my friend, but your country is one of the stupidest countries just because of the government you have. Not Nothing personal to you, but to your government it's they are out of their mind now, that's changed my attitude I have nothing to do with america but i like that i have lived there and people are okay there i like nothing against the people but not the not the government that's that's i think this is the biggest this is the upside down what happened right now i don't want to be political here i just hate this but it's just like what's going on with me is kind of like are you so stupid over there oh my gosh i don't know i don't believe i don't believe it's happening okay yeah so we can talk and talk about life and about making money online uh, there is there are so so many possibilities maybe one day i will talk and share with you how you can even do you know it's we are talking it's guys that I have been in dropshipping since 2014. I learned thing or two. We are talking about only small corner here, small corner here, eBay dropshipping. But you can expand the same eBay dropshipping to all sorts of different ways. The same thing on all sorts of different ways. That's what some of my students does, clients. Dropshipping is, uh, I think I'm, wasn't that video I made about the name, how we, I think I made it on English as well, about the name, how we represent ourselves on eBay, how we name our stores, how we name ID, our IDs. Okay, because you can do this. Uh, it's Dropshipping is only one small part on the internet. But you can, guys, you can, you can do, you can open a Pinterest account and you can post you can advertise on Pinterest free. One thing, okay? You can, uh, Facebook is not working very well, so Facebook is crap. But on Pinterest, you can do this. Is this is uh, because how do I know? Because one of my clients he's working like that. I will on the Pinterest on Etsy, dropshipping, okay? Everything connected. Then he have a blog, 
case, somebody is working for him to writing blogs. So on that blog, he is making kind of like reviews on the products. The links are there, okay, which leads to their to his eBay store. Okay. Plus, this blog generates extra income because of the on the side there, on the side there, there is uh, the advertising. He got paid for the advert for allowing the companies to advertise on his blog. Okay. So it's 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 a huge what you can do if you want to expand. But to do this, you have to start somewhere. And the best way is to start eBay, Amazon. When you start out there and connect all dots together in the right place, then you can just expand, 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 whatever you want to do. You can even do as some of my private clients, they are ordering now stuff from China. Mm -hmm. They make orders in China by themselves. They got whole stock booms in America, okay? on their garage and then they're spreading out and they something they leave something in the garage and they send something to Amazon and they send some parts of to the buy to the to the contract buyer they made a contract to the buyer already which is another company some sm small stores and they're distributing that stuff uh, by themselves but it's kind of like you know it's it, I mean, it's all started how how you list the product there and how you represent yourself on the internet people are going on the internet now more than ever buying i mean and selling as well we got more competition but but that's the thing that's the thing what you can do you can do crazy things crazy things quality products luis uh, it sounds good but uh, first uh, don't mention your uh, shop here just you know you don't want some people to spy on you uh, i would add something like uh, you can use quality products yeah but but i would be more specific because quality products what does it mean it means everything right but if you let's say put something like a hiking quality products you know what i mean or pet quality products you don't have to do this, but just narrow down and make more specific because you are going to gain more specific views on uh, Google by that. But if you just put quality products, it's kind of like too general. Okay. Okay. You change your name here, yeah. Whatever is changing, I I can't follow all the names changed. But some people who appear on uh, my videos or on my Facebook group or in my courses, I I know them. But some people I I can't remember all people. But it's okay. Thanks for coming here anyway. Okay, how are we doing, guys? I think we have to finish now and uh, thanks for being here and uh, we're going to talk to you soon probably or we'll find some time some topic I have a lot of things to talk about but uh, just um, just hope you got some value out of this video at least and you're welcome Luis and uh, <laughs> any sales you haven't made then you have to watch this video from the beginning because i mentioned something very important how you start out selling some strategy i gave you some strategy other people paid money for that to get that strategy and that's the strategy what i work with in every single private client and guess what at the beginning all of them hate me mm -hmm. because i'm forcing them to sell like this but at the end, every single body who hated me, they were so thankful to me because this strategy works like a charm. Okay. So because that makes money. Okay, and uh, that's the thing. Okay, good. Take care. See you soon. Bye-bye.